Welcome back everybody. It's time to lock down something different and new today. We are playing The Shore. This is an indie game off of Steam that I just discovered like a few weeks ago and I was so pumped about it. This is a Lovecraftian game. It looks freaking awesome from the trailer. I don't know much about it, but I was so hyped about this game when I saw it. And then I saw it was coming out in like two weeks. I was like, holy frick, I'm buying that ASAP. It just came out today and I am pumped to see what this game is going to bring. Uh, I know it's going to, it's a little bit of a shorter game, but it looks freaking dope. So if you guys enjoy, make sure to leave a like and subscribe because we'll probably be doing a couple parts to this to finish it out. But yeah, let's, uh, Let's see what happens here. Hopefully my controller works good with it. <laughs> my dear Ellie, I have to find her. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, we're moving. And my controller is sensitive. All right, let's see. Are my buttons working? All right, I got to make sure my stuff's working. Hold on. All right, I don't know if I can actually interact or do anything yet, so we're just going to have to see. This is the true test here. A to interact. Oh, no. It's not working. Certain buttons are, but not all of them. Right of oh, what? Oh, it worked. Oh, what a man needs to keep moving before he loses his sanity and his will. Walking along the shore reminded me of the walks I used to have with my wife. Oh, poor guy. Alright, maybe my bunk, uh, button uh, functions are just a little backwards. We're going to have to see. But I can't jump yet. Let's see, can I spacebar to jump? Not yet, so... Oh, can I... Can I climb these rocks? No. We're good. This looks like I can interact, right? Yeah. There we go. Interesting. We armed ourselves and walked along the shore. To our surprise, we came across other ships that had wrecked without any trace of survivors. It was like a graveyard for ships. Our compass goes mad any time we try to set a course off the island. Our captain says it's because of the volcanic dust. Volcanic dust. Sounds like the captain was right. Interesting. They speak of a fisherman who was lost in a stranded sea. He never came back. Now I know where he lies. What misfortunes could have drove him here? Hmm. Seems ominous. Give me another thing, yeah. I've offered my right arm and spoke the correct words in his absence. Only pain accompanies me towards my demise. I was forced to leave the lighthouse. There's something wrong in all of us. Only the slumbering God can save us now. Hmm. What God is he talking about? What's that say? Ah, Cthulhu. It's a Cthulhu chant. All right, let's see if we can get up and out of here. There's a lighthouse. Cool. Can I, like, take it, though? Guess not. Oh, there's a big tower over there. Oh, is that, like, an obelisk? What is that? Like, holy f what the frick yo you guys saw that right I kind of want to go back let me see is this just gonna make me go mad what's that oh what the heck Mom is now dead, and soon I will never come. Oh, stop it! It's not my daughter's voice. What the heck? K 
Okay, we didn't see any tentacles now. Okay, it's time to go to the lighthouse. It's freaking me out. As we sit our feet in the sand for the last time, she asked me to tell her one of my stories about the wild sea. I could hear each of her breaths being shorter and shorter. And by the time I finished my story, pneumonia took her life. Daughter died of pneumonia. Okay. Someone's been here. That's fresh. Oh. Oh, there's some big teeth you got there, huh? Hmm, that's gonna come into play later, isn't it? That's what I think. Wait, did I just see something again? A short blue tongue. I tried to speak to them, but they hissed and growled. No symmetrical shape that could define a logical form. Handshake it. Whoa! Artifact. This statue it looks ancient. Captain says we should take it back with us and that it would make us rich. David, on the other hand, believes that, that a foul stench of evil dwells within it. What utter rubbish. From the moment we wrecked here, he hasn't stopped talking about bad luck and otherworldly omens. He said to throw it back into the sea. He's almost certainly mad. He's obsessed with these disgusting leeches. We have worms and stuff in our stomachs. Hmm... He went to the third floor to continue his studies. So, third floor is where that guy was doing his studies. Interesting. Can I check out anything else over here? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, it's a key. Well, thank you. I will probably need that. Well, that's weird. All right, let's go up further, shall we? More coins. And this one is warm. What the heck was that? Was that dude? Dude, this game is tripping me up right now. Seeing stuff. Very interesting. There's a piece missing. We'll find it. That's Dagon. Dagon. For sure. Those uneducated fools. They won't let me write for them. They're all fishermen with dirty scuffed clothes and smell horrible. Their beards reek of alcohol and spit comes out when they talk. I'd rather stay another four hours at this point and take care of the problematic mechanisms of this handcrafted construct. I do not regret this journey. It certainly made life more interesting since then. Not to mention the view from up here. All of the hatred, misery, and sadness of mankind fade away into the line where the sea and the sky collide. It is not wrong there. Okay, so we turned on the lighthouse. And 
That looks interesting. Hmm. Guess we go back down. Let's see what else is happening here. Look for that chess piece. See if we can make our way behind this. Oh. Oh. Gonna have to crouch, come on. Try as I might with the mouse, this is gonna suck, that's for sure. How did they manage to let him die in here? What made them forsake their civil ways? That's a handprint. All right, before I go... Okay, we're finding handprints. Before I go any further, I gotta see if I can figure out my controller. All right, I think we got it. So now we have the inventory up, which is pretty nice. And... Can run. We got the crouch working. There we go. And we're gonna have to make sure everything else works as we do it, but I don't think uh, we can jump yet. And I don't think we can, like, do other stuff yet. So, let's keep moving around here and see what other clues we can find. Oh, hello. Oh. Okay, then. N nothing happened. Uh, all right. Good to know. We got to infuse it from that rock, I think. That's my guess. Can I get up here? No? All right. See, this worries me. Should I be able to jump and do stuff? I don't know. Oh. I don't think I'm allowed on those rocks. That's okay. What's over here? We haven't been over here yet. Okay. Holy frick. Holy frick. Okay. There's something I would like to show you. No. What is that voice? No. Get out of my head. What the heck? Yeah, a pit full of skeletons. I really want to... Really eager to jump in here. I mean, I guess we'll do it, but I'm going to be checking around first. See if there's anything we're missing. You got to check around. All right, we're going in. Frick it. Oh, hello. This monolith is the key of the silent. Break it free. Break free the monolith, and then we get off the island. And go mad in the process. Are we timed? Well, I think we're timed. Hopefully my sprint is working. Sometimes it feels like it's not. Sometimes I feel like I'm going slow. Okay. That one's still spinning. Good, good, good. Let's go to the next one. Too quiet. Did we miss our chance? No. We doing anything here? Go hit this one now. Let's see. Will you move for me? Oh. See the world through the eyes of a god. 
like a dream in a flash of light. Whoa. Beware the existence of mind and grasp time in your conscious mind. Whoa. Okay, okay. You set it free, now what? Can I follow you? Nope. Where do we go now? Do we just leave? How long is this cutscene? I guess we're going back? Why did I miss it? Whoa, whoa. Okay. Is it still walking over there? It is, okay. Go try to do something else. I, I don't know. What do we do now? Go turn that, I guess. See if that works now. Let's see. It's moving. It's doing something. Work now? Dang it. Okay. See, I can't go up there. All right. The thing is cruising. Oh, can I do this? Oh, we got to match it? Oh, this one. Okay, okay, okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. I see, I see, I see. As a young boy, I remember my father talking about this island. He described it in a way that would scare the listener. He spoke of black butterflies. Five. There was a man aboard named Alan who went missing after the shipwreck. I cut off his other dialogue. I found him walking alone. I'll have to wait next time. Can I take these eggs? To our surprise, we saw that he had this fixed expression on his face, as if he had seen something horrifying. His hands... His hands and arms were paralyzed in a position like if he was protecting himself from something. This island feels like it's maintained, untouched by time. The wind and the waves pause for a minute to rest. The calm before the storm. Alright, I think he's done with dialogue, so we're gonna go grab this. I'm sending this message as a cry for help. May the waves of the sea be kind. Pollen and I are castaways. I'm trying to find where this island is on the map. This doesn't make any sense. The sun is setting in the east. Fog will allow us to see through the scope that far. I can barely describe what I have witnessed today. The old fool Alex suddenly went insane. He started stuffing his mouth with rocks. Whoa. So, a small whale. Ah. It was made by an artist. New one. And our greatest catch. How did it end up here? This was meant to be completed by the end of December. Despite his fear about the island, he would often come here fishing some very colorful fish. I remember finding myself quite disturbed as I watched him stuff his mouth with their raw meat. Can we get to that? 
Looks like we can. Oh, hello. That is, uh... <laughs> That's not a left attack. Alright. Where is that guy going? That statue did not like me touching it. Where else do we go on here? I guess we can try to open that other tome. I don't know where this guy's destination is going, but... I'm intrigued. Can I go this way? Alright, we found another way. Ah, the little meteorite. This is color out of space material here. Dang. Okay. Yeah, it was just a color we had. <laughs> you can't see it, but achievement unlocked. It was just a color. Classic. Is this stopping now? No, it's still going. I almost feel like we're timed, but I have no clue. This is the wrong one, isn't it? Oh, no, it's not. Okay. All right, good, good. Where will you lead me? This place feels like it was always a part of me. As if it has taken a hold of me and won't let go. Another foot in the sand, but this time sink deeper beneath the shore. Day 30. Elliot is trying to put together the broken parts on a boat we found. If he manages to build it, then we might have a chance of a in this place. We have to try at least. There's only three of us left now in our crew. We can't afford to waste any more time here. As if time exists in this place. I think I'm starting to lose my mind. I can hear my breath after a screeching sound pierces my ears. If you are reading this, then don't look for us. Well, dang. We can't... It doesn't seem to let us get to the wreckage very much. We can go into the water a little bit. It, like, teases you with where you can go. It's like, yeah, you can go here. No, you can't. Sorry. Another picture. Doggo. Looking upon my daughter's toy gave me some sort of happiness. And I can't take my mind off the idea she's been taken by one of those creatures. Well, I thought she died, though. Wait, I'm confused. Didn't he say she died? Pneumonia took her or something? Now she was taken by a creature. Maybe he's just going insane. It's not my fault. The person has already died. She spoke about a shadow whispering between the rocks. We can't stay on it. Solitude and peace is what a soul seeks after being free. But they die in vain. It appears they were murdered. What a horrible way to find solitude. Murdered. Oh, I can jump now. Yay! Slowly letting me do stuff. Alright, give me this cool looking two thing. Oh, that's just a straight up picture of them. That's, uh... You got a great shot there. Okay, let's go find that other path. All right. More pictures. Oh, those are creepy men staring at us. What else do we got going on in here? When I touch you... Now what? Oh. Oh. A gem into the cosmos. Fair enough. Thank you. I appreciate it. Oh. What? I'll do anything. Anything to see her face again. Whoa. Okay. 
We gotta keep setting creatures free? Oh my gosh, what is that? Holy cow. Okay. Oh, ow, 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 ow. What happened? I got a little tick of madness. What was that? What? 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 Oh! 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 Oh, 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 no, 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 Oh, gosh. No, please, I'm trying to run. Come on. Oh, come on, I'm trying to run. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, that's a cool death sequence. Okay. We died. Oh. Oh, okay, we're... We're back here. All right. I think that's a good place to pause, knowing that we got to outflee a creature. Uh, if you guys are enjoying the shore, leave a like. Make sure to subscribe. Stay tuned for the next episode. And, yeah, it's uh, pretty sweet so far. They've got some really cool stuff that no game has done before with the Lovecraft universe. So this is really, really cool. So if you're enjoying, subscribe. Stay tuned. And we will see you guys in the next video.